We're back no one's not bullying me. You can tell I take myself very serious. I'm the example for everyone. I want you to look and follow me. By God, we'll get there, right? No. I don't take myself serious. I wouldn't be here if I might... If I had my way, I'd go back to my mom's tummy and get her to take some kind of abortive method and die. Oh, no! Man, all those other guys got to do it. And they didn't go through this crap. Especially the part where it bothers your conscience watching all these wonderful people brutalize each other. That's the worst of all. Man, when I woke up to that one, that's it. That's, I'm really frying now. You know what color my rear end is? My God. I didn't know there was such a color. It's just, and it neons too. <laughs> I look in the mirror, my rear end, man. So many colors coming off of that thing. I'm saying, man, didn't know your rear end could show that many, <laughs> that many colors. My God. No, well, I don't take myself serious with a rear end that's showing that many colors. And I certainly wouldn't take it out on you. What I? Hook nose. Hook nose. Pookie's got a joke, just can't get off. So. You know that, you know that. I'll tell it to you sometime. Some of you might not know it. It's a cute little joke about inspiration and inhibition. <laughs> and they usually run like this. Inspiration, inhibition. You know what happens? <laughs> Nothing. Inspiration and inhibition usually go, Ooh, got a grant, got a grant. I'm inspiration and inhibition. I got to need a grant, 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 and I got an addiction. You know, got a grant, got a grant. I got to inject myself. I'm inspiration, I'm inhibition, and I slither under the rug. Got a grant for me, federal government. Got a grant for me in your mind. Oh, humanity, look at me. I'm inspiration and inhibition. I don't know my rear from my, and my fanny's not on fire at all. If your fanny's not on fire right now, you have a problem. Know it. And don't find me in an afterlife. And you will. Want to bet? I hope you want to bet. You think there's an afterlife? You'll find me. Like Harry Quine. <laughs> he was the man I had talked to once. During my apprenticeship. You think you're going to, you think you're a graduate when you hit the afterlife or an apprentice? Mr. Metamorphosis. Well, I'm neither. <laughs> I just finally is. And I don't graduate. And I don't apprentice. I live. That I didn't get to live now. More of it anyway. What? And a lot more than that. <laughs> and a lot more than that. But Puka, I don't want to. Puka kind of keeps me in suspense. The in fact, anything about the afterlife, I know nothing about it. I just want to prepare myself in case, like you do. So in case... Don't find me because of how you refuse to live here, basically. And I find that in my maker's dream chamber and eat it. I have an appetite for that. Which reminds me, I must not be human in some way. And the police said, sir, you think you're reptilian. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm reptilian. By the way, the police are very wonderful, curious human beings. They're not always here to indict. You know, 911, you call for help, you get indictment. That's not everything the police is about more than indict. You think the police is, oh, they're just about indictment. Do you want to bet? Maybe the district attorney, not the police. Who lives more backed up above, not above the law, but above Crime above the reasoning, above the whole thing. The police are so far ahead of the DA, it ain't even funny. And the whole logic is just, you gotta get rid of the DA. The police are their own DA. The police ought to do their own DA work. That's for sure. Oh, oh they're brutal. Well, I, I see that happening. 
I do. Well, I see a lot more instances where they're not brutal. I mean, so many instances where police have contact, no brutality. None. None. It was not even in the mood of any of them. I mean, arresting people and giving them tickets and just stopping them and talking and busting them and inquiring or whatever. There's no brutality. None. Now, there is a grain of brutality. I ain't arguing that. And I, it's, in most cases, the report doesn't match the instance. No, no, on no side is anybody. Why? Because these cases of brutality, they're insured. Well, are you going to get an accurate report from anybody? How in God's name do you have brutality insured? I, why well, they got to suffer the lawsuit? Aha, uh -huh. now we're getting to a problem here, aren't we? The lawsuit. And insuring brutality doesn't fit in justice, does it? And the Bar Association is full well aware of that. And still just the money. Well, get going, Bar Association. Because this ain't working. And humanity is a suffering in all kinds of ways. Fiscally. You want to get to what everyone's got on their heart? Fiscal? Well, let me tell you. This ain't working, Bar Association. And you're costing this place a plenty. You are overhead. One of that, and not worth your weight on this ship. Off the deck. Perform, or get thrown off. Marshall, you're overhead with all your reasoning and effect. Do you understand me? Bar Association. <clears throat> Ain't got nothing to do with your feelings, employee. Nothing to do with them. You got employees in, in rank and file in the DA's office that have feelings. They are fired. That's like me have feelings installing pipe. No, I don't. I'll tell you what I have. No, that pipe has to do. Function. That's all. Function. Your method ain't, and feelings won't. Mm -hmm. Don't get me started on feelings, and you have no business with any of them. One feeling, mutual, and it doesn't have grudge to it. There's more grudge going on in the DA's office than, than in the Al-Qaeda. Why? Why does the DA's office have any grudge? The police officer certainly doesn't. The criminal doesn't. That's not the criminal's problem. And you got a grudge issue. Why? I wonder why. Bar associate, bar associate. Mummy, mummy, mummy. Overhead to this society. Out. Get off the deck. Or function. And I don't know how it's going to take you generations to get this one figured out, I'll bet. Like, looked like the sheriff of Nottingham. 